Hey guys and girls and welcome to Game Slobs. My name is Coops and today we're going to be doing Path of Fire. This uh, instance is called Crystalline Memories. Now, um, the last episode uh, we found Vlast and we found Balthazar and his champion, his little stooge. We killed his little stooge and then Balthazar nearly killed us but Vlast sacrificed himself to save us. Uh, complete WTF moment is like, oh my god, oh my god, things are happening. So it was really like epic on so many proportions. Um, now the the bit in between that and this uh, this instance was a bit of a ball ache. You had to go and get your your Springer, and um, you had to find the rest of the crystals uh, which Blasters left behind as like sort of um, instructions, as it were, memories, recordings of of itself. You know, giving advice to Orin or Orin's champion which is obviously us. Um, it was a bit of a ball ache to get them really and with the amount of time it's taken me to actually do it my enthusiasm level for it was way up here and I was just ready and ready to get straight into the next instance my enthusiasm level just and I'm a bit like oh I'm a bit deflated now. Um, I think there kind of needs to be a balance of you know when something exciting happens Arena and I have got to understand that we want to get straight into the next bit you know let that next instance be a bit like, okay, let's bring them down a little bit. Then we can get them doing all the grindy shit that really pisses them off. You know what I mean? So, yeah, that I would have preferred it that way. But anyway, I'm not, I'm I'm not, I'm not going to let it affect my mood. I'm going to try not to let it. Um, and we're going we're gonna to press on. Press on. So, going for crystalline memories. I had to push myself up against a wall because of all the branded that are in the area. So, are we certain okay. this is the place? Hey, look who finally showed up. Hi. No sign of Krakatoric, Commander. It's definitely moved south. And no branded either. Not yet, anyway. That's surprising to hear, considering we are surrounded by brand. The landscape yeah. certainly makes an ominous impression. All the more reason to finish our business here quickly. Well then, yeah. Ritlock, Casimir, care to take point? Which way is Glint's lair? Uh, I have no idea. Oh, do I, I. Do, I, do, I do, I do, I do. Come again. When the Commander Jory and I were inside, we got there through a portal. Not the same as walking through the front door. Technically, I'm not even sure there is a front door. There is. Don't if worry. there is, we'll find it. Let's get moving. Yes, let's. Find your way into Glint's Lair. Um, I know how to get into Glint's Lair in Guild Wars 1. That's any help to you. <laughs> um, yeah, Guild Wars 1, I, it was, uh, I'm not sure whether it was a dungeon or... Um, like a mission, an instance mission, but yeah, you could go in and be bored. So we're going into Glint's Lair by the looks of things, which is going to be interesting. I wonder whether it's all been corrupted. Um, when we went in through that portal, the hourglass portal, that may have just been like a sort of memory of it. Maybe? So it might be all corrupted and all purpley sort of colour. Would be interesting. Well, it would be interesting to see what it's like. That's if we actually managed to get in there. Shut right down there. Exactly. No, you won't. Stop shooting me. I'm cold for. Oh, that's annoying. Oh, I do love that. It's like my favourite down skill. It's just so awesome. 
a little bit overpowered, don't you think? Okay, that's that. Looks like the Forged got a head start on us. We have to find the weapon before they do. Before Balthazar does. I'm not so sure this weapon is their only priority. These Forged aren't just hunting parties. By the looks of it, they've been dug in here for some time. Yeah, something is definitely up. Let's take a look around and see what we find. <sighs> okay. Oh, okay. Go around and have a look. Search the area. I do so love these. <laughs> uh, da -da -da -da. Nothing but exit there. Oh, what's that? Hmm. Is this whatever they're building here? It must be enormous. Can. This thing is drawing power from branded crystals. How is that even possible? <laughs> well, there it you looks go. like they're mining branded crystal, but for what? Hmm. Well, there's something around here. Like they're doing it some kind of honor. Sauce. Looks sturdy too. But what are they using it for? The Iron Legion would kill for plating like this. And has several times over. <laughs> okay, and this is obviously something over by Canuck, I would imagine. Commander, take a look at these tracks. Any idea what made them? Something large and heavy. You probably already guessed that, but otherwise, no. I've never seen tracks like these. Hmm. Find anything? The Forged have been busy. Whatever they're up to, they've rebuilt the area to suit their needs. It appears Balthazar's found a way to harness power from branded crystals. Between that, the plane yes, and those tracks. It must be some kind of war machine. Maybe it has something to do with the weapon Vlast was talking about. It's possible. But we're not getting any answers until we get into Glint's lair. Find a way into Glint's lair. Let's do this. Okay. Ah, oh, of course we'd find the branded. Watch yourself. Branded. These devourers, that's what annoys me. They they bury themselves and they run away and then obviously all your skills are doing nothing to them. It does my head. Like just die with some dignity for God's sake. Like me. Die with some dignity. Boom. Yeah, bitches. He's about to tunnel himself away, and then you can't hit him. And he's like, so Did anybody fun. else feel that? Something What's this? powerful. Glint. Oh. I can sense her. Impressive trick for a dead dragon. Any competing theories? Yeah, stoic twig. Says Chris. Why am I being drawn here? Oh, hello. These heroes are not what I expected. Do they have the courage to endure what's coming? The will to drive it back? 
Tyrion's last hope rests on the unity of the races. The pooling of their strength. It is the only way. That's Glint. She's Tell talking about is. Destiny's Edge. This must be like the memory crystals Vlast left behind. A distillation of Glint's thoughts. You think this will help us get inside Glint's lair? I'm not sure. But it's the best lead we've got. Spread out and see if we can find more crystals. I think I see a memory crystal over there. Oh, cool. Okay. This is this is pretty cool. Hearing from Glint again, that's right that's there. pretty Looks sweet. Like a job for your Springer. Hey, Commander. Uh, I found oh something. God, look at this place. feeling we're gonna end up going down there. Okay. Um there's one up there. Go Springy Springer. Go Jerry. <laughs> Jerry. <laughs> My Jerry Springer. Ah oh, funny. Boing, got it. Really? Any really more annoying. Oh wow, he's reflecting, that's annoying. Probably best not to shoot. That's, that's the problem with Elementalist. It's all projectiles. <laughs> You're always getting things reflected back at you. Boing! Ah, hoo ha. Um, I wonder whether I can get over with uh, my Raptor. Yeah, no. Give it a go this way with the boinger. Mm, that one. I don't like how you have to keep swapping. That's annoying. There we go. We're up. Although I do like these crystals. They're pretty. Boinger. Ah. to crown the Doric. It no longer compels my actions. My will is my own. I am free. I see Tyria as I've never seen it before. <sighs> Glenn never talked about what it was like before she was cleansed. Must have been a lot to process. Mm. To say the least. Okay, so we need to collect more crystal essence. Find and collect all the crystal essence. God. Well, this could take some time. Is there any up there? Doesn't look like it. Oh, look, there's some over there. 16 to collect. Yeah, takes me back to my childhood. <laughs> I love how Commander, red looks like. I found another crystal. <laughs> I think we're on the right track. 
Oh dear. Yeah, run, little luck, run. So, where's the other bits? Uh, probably up here. There's one up there. Is there one up there? Yeah, there's one up there. Go a bit further up, maybe we can find some up here. What's in there? Absolutely nothing. Now it does like the perfect place for an entrance. Just saying. Just throwing that one out of there. Oh, there's one up there as well. Jeez Louise. Come on, Jerry. Let's go. Whee! Let's get the raptor to jump across there. So annoying having to like switch between them all. Ah, okay. Let's just bash you. Ah, oh, there's one more. Oh, there's one there I missed up. That's lovely, thank you. Thank you, yes. Might as well kill it. You've got nothing better to do than, you know, stand around wasting your time. Just die! Oh my god. Ah, oh, oh, that was close. Um, okay. I think I've collected. Enough. I mean, there's like some up there or something stupid we could like. Yeah, I'm gonna have to come back here later to collect the rest. I know I will. There's nine left to get, and I don't think I'm gonna find them all. With the aid of the forgotten, I have come to terms with my freedom. But freedom. I'm finding it comes with a heavy burden. My, my, my mind is drawn to the suffering of tyrannous people, the inescapable doom they face. I, I feel a sickness in my heart, the first stirrings of compassion. I, I turn their plight over and over in my mind. The elder dragons. The world consumed. I, I can abide these visions no longer. There must be something I can do. So this is when Glint decided to help the mortal races. We were fortunate. Could have just as easily gone the other way. Okay. Two, three, four. Okay. We've got a crystal over here, Commander. Oh, wow. Okay. That was easy. There's the others to get. Ah, uh, shut up. Yeah, I'm going to. I might not even be able to, because it's not level 3 yet. Boing up. Boing up. Oh, there's one over there, look. Now that I will definitely need my raptor for. Okay. 
Let's kill these first. I don't know why when people won't help me, but they know. Yes. Okay, you can die now. So how many have we got left to get? Three. I'm not gonna find them all, I just know I'm not. There's a little ledge up there, but I can't see any more. Who knows, there may be some more further down. Oh, there's one. <laughs> see? See that? I probably missed one, and I'll probably have to come back, but oh well. At least I've helped you guys to locate a few. I think. Okay. Alas, my child. Your birth begins a new age, a new design. I, I sense Grelkatorik stirring in its sleep. Could it know what I'm planning? What you are meant for? Time grows short. I fear what will happen when the Elder Dragon awakens. And I'm sorry, you must bear this burden. missed one uh, is it up there maybe probably can I be bothered nah let's go let's do this Vinsler okay Wait to explore this place Oh, this looks so Casmia, is everything all right? Yes, it's just... This is definitely the place the Commander Jory and I were brought to, but it's... changed. The brand is spread here. <sighs> I wish she was here. Oh, yeah, so do I. This is the spear Glint gave us to kill Kralkatorik, fashioned from its own blood. I had no idea it survived the fight. This must be it. The weapon Vlast was talking about. We found it. Oh. Ah, oh, hello. It's one of Flint's Crystal Guardians. There's the welcoming committee. So, what's our move, Commander? Do we kill it, or...? It's corrupted. Take it down. Yeah, we kill it, of course. I don't know how, mind you. Wait, what's this? What does that do? Crystal shield. Juices incoming damage, okay. Damn, son. Yeah. The shields. Probably an achievement to complete this without using the shields. That'll be fun. I'm loving this music. Ah, fuck. There we go. 
I got it. Open up on the bad boy. Ah, no, target the goddamn thing. Okay, halfway there. He's gonna blow. Oh, damn, son. <laughs> awesome. I think I upset him. Can't do anything. Oh god, I made him really mad. Give me Dark Shield. Need to get a light and a dark. You get it. You need the shield and the dark thing. So you get protected while you're running towards him. Go, 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 go. Oh, fuck a nun. Oh my god. Not gonna lie, that's annoying. So yeah, I mean, you can just dodge in there to get it, but probably easier to... Oh, wow. Already? This will be easier with two. You can have one person running around getting the shields and just running back to him and blowing him up. Okay. Roar! 
dead, bitch. Look, the way's clear now. Look, I saw this and I was like, oh my god, it snaps Gollum. Oh, that's incredible. It's just kind of bringing the whole story together. Like, everything we knew from the kind of interval is bringing it all together and just giving us little Easter eggs here, there, and everywhere. And it's just like, yes! Ah, oh, loving it. There's a memory crystal. That is one hell of an intact memory crystal. Right there. Prophecy is not always a gift. Often I see things I wish I hadn't. But when the vision is clouded, I am most uneasy. The, the heroes have gathered and crowd the Turing approaches. I, I, I am not yet prepared to face the Elder Dragon, and, and distressingly, I cannot see beyond the coming of battle. Is, is it because I die? I, I can't yes. die without finishing my work. I have to stop Krelkatoric. Mm. The Forgotten told me much, but not everything. What did they tell the Six? What, what do the gods know that I do not? So, so much is unclear. But I am out of time. I must keep my faith and hope that my children will carry on my legacy. Glint never said anything to Destiny's Edge about a legacy. Only the Krokotorik had to be stopped. Stopped, yes, but killed? Do you suppose she knew about the consequences? Maybe that's why Vlast sent us here. To destroy the Dragon's Blood Spear. Bad idea, boss. Glint told us that weapon was made specifically to kill Kralkatorik. If we destroy the spear, we'll be powerless to stop it. Unless you got a pile of dragon slaying gear I don't know about. Killing them is no longer an option. Not without a plan to deal with the aftermath. Balthazar doesn't care what will happen to Tyria. We can't risk the spear falling into his hands. We have to destroy it. <sighs> Fine. Just so long as I'm on Sorry. record, this is a bad idea. So, Glint wanted to kill Kralkatorik, or stop Kralkatorik. It's interesting to me that Glint didn't actually know well, the gods plan that the fact that Glint doesn't actually know something that's that's scary because Glint knows everything, Glint is like all seeing. So, yeah, the mere fact that Glint doesn't know something that's that that's kind of don't like that. Bang. Goes. The task is done. Now let us all imagine Balthazar red-faced and frustrated over his failure to stop us. Ah, oh, maybe that's what ah, he yes, wanted. that's lovely. I just hope we made the right decision. I feel lost without the guidance of the gods. Is Ritlock okay? He's brooding. Char loved to brood. I'm sure he's fine. You mind checking in on him, Commander? This was Snaff's Golem, wasn't it? What's left of it, yeah. I failed my guildmates, Commander. I failed Glint. Balthazar wasn't the only one I ran into during my time in the Mists. I also met Glint. She taught me the ways of the Revenant. I thought she meant for me to finish the job Destiny's Edge started. But here we are, trying to save Kral Katorik. That damn dragon is still alive. And Glint, Snaff, and Air, they're all dead. I need a win, boss. I gotta make this right. Let's take Balthazar down. To be fair, though, 
to be fair, only Glint was killed by Kralgatorik. So, you know, the other dragons, you know, killed the others, so you gotta, you gotta, you know, be fair about that. So the spear's destroyed. Can we go kill that loathsome god now? We've stalled Balthazar's plans, but we're no closer to bringing him down. And we'd all like to avoid a repeat of our last encounter. Commander, we're rudderless. We need guidance. I think we should go to the gods and ask them ourselves. Ask them ourselves? You mean go to the mists? Yes. Uh, I'm not sure I like the sound of that. Oh, please, And let's. if Ritlock really did meet Balthazar in the mists, maybe there's more to his story than we realized. Maybe the yes. gods really are helping us. I've done everything you've asked of me, Commander. But I... I have questions that need answering. So do I. We know we're outclassed from our last meeting with Balthazar. This may be our only way forward. All right, Kaz, oh God, we'll do it your way. The God sign. But how do we reach the gods? There's a portal to the mist at the Tomb of Primeval Kings. I think we should start there. Then that's where we'll go. Kaz is right. It's high time we got some answers. Wow. Okay. So that that's pretty cool. Uh, let me just get this. There you go. One for the boinga. So, okay. That that was going to be my question. I've been thinking about this through the video. Um, just something I wanted to really discuss was the, the gods. Okay, Bal Balthazar was in the mist, all chained up. There's only one. There's only one reason or one way that could have happened, and that's if the other gods put him there. You have to wonder, are the other gods in on this? Did they put him there for a reason? Are they good? Are they going to help us? Are they not? It, oh, it, yeah. And the the very fact that Glint said, I don't know what the gods are planning and all that is it's interesting. So it will be interesting to see the gods, I mean, just to see what they look like, like actually look like and how they talk and how they are. I mean... Having played Guild Wars 1, I know I keep wanging on about Guild Wars 1, but having played it, and you only ever see the avatars of the gods, you know, in really, <laughs> really crappy graphics for Guild Wars 1, um, to actually see the gods themselves, oh my god, that's going to be so exciting. Um, I'm, I'm really looking forward now to what comes next. Do you think they will listen to us? I hope so. Portals to other worlds, ghostly dragons, rampaging gods. Uh, we lead charmed lives, do we not? Do we not? Portals to the mists, huh? <laughs> I've seen enough of that place to last a lifetime. But, well, it's like I said, Commander. I'm gonna make this right. No way you're going without me. Yeah, I still miss Kaz, uh, not Kazmir, sorry, uh, Marjorie. Still miss her. I miss having Tiny with us. But yeah, so, okay, that was um, a bit long-winded for my liking, but it's... I was thinking, actually, that this was going to bring the story down a little bit, down a pace, and just, you know, it wasn't as really, oh my god, wah, um, as, as the last episode but this makes me want to go on even more. It's like, oh my god, so we're actually going to go and seek out the gods. We're going to the Tomb of the Primeval King, which was a place in Guild Wars 1. Um, and it was a place to... I think it went to the Underworld, if if memory serves. I think that's where, where the tomb actually led to, the Underworld. So it'll be interesting to see. Um, I'm going to get on with that pretty soon. Uh, I don't really... Have any predictions as such? Uh, I will be interested to see what the gods, if we actually meet the gods, what they will have to say. Why they chained Balthazar up. Maybe he just went rogue. Maybe he just went a bit too far with it all. Or just pissed them off in some way that he bas they basically chained him up. Um, I don't remember uh, off, off the top of my head. I don't remember um, whether Balthazar's avatar was there when um, 
in Nightfall, you actually meet all the avatars of the gods. And they basically, <laughs> I mean, in essence, they say, yeah, we're not going to do anything to help you. You're on your own. Do it yourself. Why should we intervene? You know, we, we are we are gods and everything, but you'll never learn if you don't do it yourself. So I can't, I'm pretty sure Balthazar's um, avatar was actually there then. So that must mean that in the 250 years since Guild Wars 1... That's that's when that gap there is when Balthazar was trapped in the mist, you know, chained up in the mist. So obviously by the other gods. So what exactly happened in that time from being one of the gods? And it's only been 250 years since Guild Wars One. Something must have happened. Um, maybe he wanted to come back uh, for some reason. They were like, no, we don't want you to come back. We want you to stay here with us. I don't know, I'm clutching at straws here. I guess if I just play, I'm going to find out. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. So please tune in tomorrow when I will be doing the next episode. I'll be doing it like right now, but you will get to see it tomorrow. Um, really excited. Um, the this, this story is so much better than Heart of Thorns. Um, it's bringing all the old lore back. It's coming full circle and sort of explaining the backstory more of what happened in the past 250 years. Um, I mean, even to the extent that you, you've got Snaps Gollum there. I mean, Snaps Gollum? Really? We're going into Glint's Lair and, oh, it's all happening. So I'm really excited to see where the story is going to go from here. Um, thanks very much for watching, guys. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe and leave comments about how overly giddy I'm getting about this this whole uh, expansion. It's like, ah! Um... And I will catch you guys tomorrow. I love you all with affections unspeakable. Goodbye.